Hi, Caspi on the 18th of June 2018. Uh, I'm tasting the last of these vintage port uh, barrel samples from the 2016 vintage. This is, is Taylor, so I suppose you might call Paterfamilia not just in the Fladgate partnership, but pretty much the whole of the Douro Valley, always regarded as, as the, the top of the, I suppose, regular bottlings with, with Fonseca. Um, Super deep again. It's you know it's not an opaque wine. It it uh, you can see through it. But um, let's give it a sniff. Oh, there's much going on there. That lovely, wonderful dark plum, ripe, pure fruit. A bit of licorice and nut about it. It's less spicy than than some, perhaps a cross particularly. But perhaps a little floral high note. Mm. That's got wonderful, wonderful density to it on the palate. Great definition and um, there's some stu super structure held within it. You know, this is a serious. Could you call it the Chateau Latour of, of of the Douro? Perhaps it's it's got that sort of regal, slightly martial quality to it. Um, very much a straight backbone held within there, firm backbone of, of structure. Um, but it's wonderful, sort of pure dark, um, f f uh, f pure dark fruit. It's almost got a slight umami, sort of nori seaweed type um, character to it, and this super mineral, fresh minerality through 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 the back. I think I've talked in one of the other videos about these being ports of um, terroir, but um, that really is an absolutely delicious and and highly impressive mouthful of port, I must say. Uh, there we are, that's the last of these uh, three 16s from the Flaggate Partnership, uh, 2016 Taylor, and just emphasising what a super vintage this really is.